Hi, this is David DiBiase. I'm here with my dog, Teo. We're at the uh, Whitewater Preserve out near Palm Springs, California. We're here to take a little walk today and thought it would be a good place and a good occasion to talk to you a little bit about Geography 581, Spatial Data Science Ethics. So let's go for a walk. The first question you may have is, why take a class in Spatial Data Science Ethics when there are so many other cool technical courses you could take instead? Well, one reason is that uh, spatial data science ethics is really interesting and really important. Another reason is that employers want to retain good employees and maintaining an ethical culture at work is one of the best ways to do that. And a, th a third reason is you probably want to be the kind of person that your uh, fellow workers come to when they have problems, who trust you to have good judgment to have moral reasoning skills. And this class aims to help you achieve that. So the course begins with a consideration of research ethics. And uh, you'll take a training, an online training that's required by the graduate school for uh, you to do research. After we take care of the research ethics requirement, we uh, dive a little bit into moral theory, just a little bit. And also at the same time, we look into the nature of professionalism, in particular, how professions can be defined by their particular ethical codes. In the third part of the course, we're gonna focus on geospatial ethics. That's kind of my comfort zone. I've been teaching GIS ethics and writing about the subject for quite a few years. We're gonna look at some very interesting ethical case studies in the GIS realm and we're gonna build up our moral reasoning skills by analyzing those cases methodically. In part four, we'll look into data science and the ethical challenges that arise in that field. And there's some interesting challenges, believe me, you probably heard of them, having to do with artificial intelligence, machine learning, and privacy, of course. It'll all come together with readings and scenarios in spatial data science ethics. That's new territory for everybody, and it's gonna be a lot of fun for all of us to explore it together.